Hi everyone, welcome back to Engineer Stackup channel. So guys, today I will share Virtusa client round interview. So might be this video is bit long because they have asked many question around 21 21 question we have. Okay, so watch all the video and you will get latest question. So a skill set is Java Selenium cucumber and api testing so these are the requirements uh, they are looking for experienced candidate around more than three year and you have a uh, experience in automation more than three year okay so let's move in the first question so first question is tell me about yourselves so if you are following my series so all the video what i'm uh, up, uh, uploading over there you can see the first question is always tell me about yourself so next question guys here they have also asked some basics question from uh, software testing concept as well uh, so if you are attending the client round guys so client is also looking for your testing a skill set means whatever the topics are there in manual test cases right so next question they have asked what is the what are the what is the difference between a smoke testing and sanity testing so i have uploaded the complete series of manual testing just you can go and brush up if you want to brush up your manual testing skill next question they have asked what are what is the difference between retesting and regression testing okay and next question they have asked what is the integration testing and next question they have asked what is the system testing so software testing right so mainly they will focus on the types of the testing then agile methodology then uh, they can ask the test uh, plan okay then test cases how to write the test cases and all test case technique they will ask you then they will ask you software development life cycle so software testing life cycle what is bug life cycle so they will ask you some question uh, in jira as well so these are the important uh, things you have to brush up in your software and manual testing okay so i am moving in the next question what are what is the what what are the challenges you have faced in selenium so i have made the dedicated video for the challenges faced in selenium please go through my video and watch i have added many points over there okay this is your common question uh, in many interview they have asked uh, this type of the question so next question they have asked what is the difference between get text and get attribute so if you are learning the selenium and these are the very common method guys so text means you can capture the text which is available on the web page and get attribute so according to whatever the attribute value we have we will get those value and both type is the string type next question is how to select the specific value in drop down okay so how to handle the drop down in selenium so if you have a select tab then a select tag then we can use select class and you could you could say sometimes we have a normal drop down okay so a normal drop down how generally we are uh, using the selenium right so you have to capture uh, all the element right and it will return the list of the web element and you can iterate and accordingly you can validate okay uh, next question they have asked which which locator is best in selenium so guys uh, this is uh, one uh, confusion like they 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 want to try to confuse you but you should not worry about that which locators means if you have a id then definitely we should go for id or if you find like name and all right then we should go for that if nothing is there then definitely you have to write your customized expert okay what is the features file so they have asked a question in cucumber as well so i think they are also going to focus on the cucumber framework understood right so if you are learning the cucumber then you know how to create a features file we have an extension called dot features next question is what is hook concept in features file and next question is 
what is the tag in features map so again i'm not going to explain your answer guys so slowly or you can follow any other tutorial as well so in my channel we don't have a kukumba tutorial but we are planning also to upload video for the kukumba tutorial as well so as of now i am working on the java tutorial okay so you can brush up the java in my uh, channel so we have uploaded many videos and coming days i will upload it also many videos okay next question they have asked what is the background what is the background okay so background means if you have a common step uh, steps those steps we can keep inside this background so what happened the steps should be not repeated in features file and this is the common steps okay what is the difference between scenario and scenario outline so scenario when you are writing the scenario and scenario outline means you are passing the text data over there right so again here i am not going to discuss the answer guys so please if you uh, if you know that is very good if you don't know please prepare well okay next question how many annotations are there in test engine so we have a list of annotation in the test engine okay so next question is what is what is the listener in test engine so i'm moving in the next question next question means how to execute one test case multiple times so we have a attribute called invocation count okay so you can use the invocation count attribute and we can run the multiple one test cases multiple time here then how to do the parallel execution if you are following my uh, video then you could see uh, how many times they have asked the parallel execution and all okay they have asked few question regarding the api testing so api testing what is the serialization and deserialization in a rest suit so when you are creating the pojo class then we can apply here serialization and deserialization concept then what is the path parameter and what is the query parameter so again you have to guys um, dress up your api testing so i have uh, already uploaded api testing series as well so if you want you can refer in my playlist so around we have a 45 video i have uploaded on api testing okay so next question is what are the authorization types you have used in your project so in real time guys we use auth 2.0 zero but many types of the authorization uh, have types we have okay but prepare well for auth 2.0 they will ask you uh, frequently they have asked this type of the question okay guys so that's it uh, in this video and definitely you will get some idea in the client round they are asking the technical question too much okay so might be they are the technical person but sometimes they want we ask this much question they will ask you some project related stuff they will ask you some your roles and responsibility and few scenario based question but here they have asked uh, too much technical question might be they are a very technical person and many of them they are asking in the client round what type of the question they will ask you and i already made the video how to prepare for the client round client round interview in the client round also they will ask you many technical question and this is your uh, one proof is there right so prepare well for the client round okay it's a not uh, easy okay you have to prepare well technically as well so what you can do guys you can watch my video and you can start to take interview yourself okay you will get all the video uh, question on my uh, screen okay so just check are you able to give the answer or not okay or note make a note for those if you are able to give the answer or not where are you not able to give the answer prepare well and make a proper notes and definitely this question will repeated in coming interview when you are attending guys and thank you so much for watching this video guys so many of them 
uh, not uh, subscribing the channel if this video is profitable for you guys please subscribe please support this channel to get more new video notification and updated interview question what what are the types of the question now these days the company is asking so in the next video bye bye